How many of you remember this song? Nigeria Jaga Jaga. Everything is scatter scatter. Poor man they suffer. Suffer. Boza Boza. Go and shut in the air. <laughs> remember this one. This one again. Food do no day, hey! or die water no day. <laughs> and I want country no good, oh. What about the Nepal people, oh, they no good. Ah! <laughs> this song, sir, song where they sing, where we think say we they suffer. <laughs> <laughs> it was a carry the shout, Nigeria Jaga Jaga. Hey! That time, hey! well, like, say it's still there to find <laughs> 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 I be six pack there. African China they they they, they shout food do not day water 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 no day that time food. <laughs> not that like yam yam na fifty there. <laughs> African China go day where I did they talk say oh God I didn't see it well. <laughs> now now the song fits. <laughs> <laughs> As at that time when they sing that song, during that time, if Pekin cry, you go see Mama. They tell and say, "No, don't cry, Junior. Don't cry. If you stop crying, I'll buy your ice cream. If you stop crying, I'll buy ice cream, Junior." <laughs> you go see Junior go stop the cry. <laughs> now they know they tell Junior to stop crying. You make the buy a something. No, hey! if Pekin cry now, na na threat. And Mama go tell and say, Junior, if you don't stop crying now. I will give you something that will make you cry. <laughs> <laughs> Even children, they hear her. <laughs> that time, children were exempted from suffering. <laughs> hmm? Suffer anything way they do as a family. They go make sure say your children no notice your sufferness. Now is inevitable. <laughs> it's inevitable. <laughs> Imagine where you go side market, make you buy yam where your children go chop. You can't go buy yam one, eleven thousand naira. You can't come back, they tell you, say, Junior, don't break TV. Hey! Junior, <laughs> I don't care how old you are, you are leaving my house. <laughs> where I rent the house, my mommy, I'm just eight. It does not concern me. Get out of my <laughs> <laughs> Now be the men jaga jaga. <laughs> now now be the men food do not day. <laughs> How many of you they hear foul they 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 crow? No matter if I hear, <laughs> not if I waste seafood for those men they cry. <laughs> he choke. <laughs> <laughs> um, before, if you go to the restaurant, they say, Sir, should we bring dessert, dessert for, for you? Dessert. Should I dessert that they call it? Dessert. <laughs> we bring for dessert for you before you chop. <laughs> now, people, they use dessert, they do meal. <laughs> <laughs> and they talk protest, people, they issue statement anyhow. You know, see, since where this protesting starts now, we confuse. We don't even know who will be president. <laughs> I bet who be our president. <laughs> <laughs> because statement plenty. As I said, give your own. President, don't I give your own. This one, I give your own. Pre press completely. Who be our president? <laughs> Who? Mama Mia. I thank all of you. Me, I'm going straight. They've, they've said everything. They've spoken all the English. So the one that I will speak, I don't know which one I'm going to speak now. Now, I want to say that I want to go to straight. We're not going to I and all those who believe in me and those of you who are committed to the interests of the Niger Delta. We are not going to be part of any protest. It's as clear as that. If the, anybody have the right to protest, I also have the right to resist protest. Where you are right, stop. That's where my right begins. I am anti-protest. Uh, people will say that they've given him money. 
That's why he's talking this way. I am now. Go take your own. Me, I don't take my own. Because because a lot of people make these claims and when they make this claim you now start to hide when they make this claim you now start to be apologetic we were all here the same formula the same pattern when our brother was there they protested Today, another of our brother is here. They want to protest. Is it truth? When you allow yourself to be used, when you always bend your back for people to ride on you, they will continue to ride on you. Like the IYC president said, our needs included in their 10 point demands? No. So we are not important to them. But it's our resources that they want to share. We are not important to, but they want to share our resources. In 2012, there was a lot of tolerance. The man who was president in the government which he served was uh, one of the most brilliant people I have had the privilege in my life to meet with. You know, even though I was much older than himself. But he treated me like a father and said why he does certain things. And so if you're tolerant about other people's opinion, you should be able to take anything. You know, if somebody says you're an idiot, it depends on the voice, and somebody else says you're an idiot, you could get annoyed yeah. with the tone of the sentence, I mean, uh, of the, uh, uh, the pronouncement. So it's difficult to really explain properly what informs uh, Tinubu. You know, if you put back your mind, this is a man I had met one on one when he was a senator. Uh, my good friend, late senator uh, uh, Kadibo. They were very close. They were all in SDP. Then I was chairman of NRC. They come to my hotel room in Abuja. They were excited. Why? Because on two occasions they had seen me with Major General Musa Yaradua, who wanted me to join his party. That he sees me on television and I'm convinced and that that would be humility. I said, no, if you win nomination of uh, SDP, I will join you, because I think you have a purpose. Then my party hadn't any purpose about which direction, and finally Stofa emerged, and I was proven right. So it, they normally see me. So that was how I got close to, to him. So I didn't see him again until he became governor. I think it was at London airport we saw. I said, for all the things you have been talking, have you shown any in practice? And he looked at me. I said, you were protesting in Lagos against PDP. This will happen. There was a time PDP took over five out of the six states. It was in Lagos that survived. And he, he, I'm not unmindful of his courage. He's a very courageous person. But I doubt if the same courage applies now. You know, there are forms of courage, thinking courage, physical courage. Are they really thinking? Because this man who has gone through the process, he just didn't fly in from the moon. He's passed through the process. He's seen all manner of persons in Lagos. The whole politician. country is Lagos. Yeah. So he's not just coming from a, an innocuous state from somewhere. So why they are not able to anticipate, to begin to adjudicate, to talk to people until they get to this point. And now you can see the serious effort being made to stop the protests. And for me, protest is expression of view. It's the, mm -hmm. Uh, unresolved, uh, you know, grievance. If you haven't resolved the grievance, somebody has the right to say it, either spoken word or moving about, saying something. But maybe they have information which we don't have. They anticipate something is going to happen. I don't know what. That's why they're in government, and we're not in government. So they have all the security information. I hope they have not also demonized people. Because part of the problem is that there are so many forms of... Uh, you know, anticipated terrorism, as I call them. What I call, you know, stochastic terrorism, where you demonize people or group of persons to incite them to terrorism. I think that's part of what this government is doing. Why they are doing it, I don't know. Maybe they want to create, create a chaotic situation that might enable them to survive. 
You know, Tinubu is a very clever person. People underrate him to their chagrin. He's a very clever person, and I don't underrate him. So they must have a purpose. They must have a purpose. But I pray it does not bring us. Are you saying Tinubu will organize protests against himself? No, no, no. That, that, yes. Oh, it is very easy. That's the, that's the climax of brilliance. You organize something against yourself and achieve a purpose you want. Because people are now, now to, people are saying, no protest, this will happen. And he's one place just watching what is going on. He's watching. Just to pick it up doesn't look easy to the common eye, but somebody can do it. Just